everyone, welcome to another Tuesday tutorial. My name is Stephanie and I'm the creative behind my prints collection. For today's tutorial, what we are going to do to create is this kind of ribbon effect to your lettering. We are going to use this word and transform from a black model a cool ribbon effect. By using my ribbon and gloss portrait brush set that you can find the link down below if you want to check them out but you can create this um, effect without the, br the brushes you can use the start concrete brushes I'm gonna be doing a series of videos with instructions and tutorials on how to best use these brushes Don't forget to subscribe and turn your notifications A new tutorial will be posted every Tuesday so let's open the Procreate app. I'm gonna open a new canvas. And I already have the word pre-made to help the, speed up the, this video in process. So I'm going to my layers and turn on the layer which has the word modern. What we are going to do is transform this letter into a ribbon effect. To do so, let's open the layers. I'm gonna add a new canvas. This one is selected, so I'm gonna draw on that one. And just, I'm just gonna reduce the opacity of the other layer just to see what I'm doing. So this is good. And going back to my layer, I'm going to select the color black, black. And then to help speed up the process, I'm going to use my ribbon and gloss procreate brush set you don't have to use this set or these brushes but i do think that they are very helpful and help speed up the process and are quite fun to use so the link is down below if you want to check them out but if you don't no worries you can use the brushes that procreate already has so i'm going to my brush library the ribbon and gloss uh, set and i'm going to choose my ribbon or it's always on top so i'm on that, that layer and then just gonna test to see the size the size is good here you can decrease or increase the size and what i'm gonna do is start painting not painting going over this word so let's start so then one of the good things about this brush is you have to go really slowly and the brush will make such a cool effect like this and then my O. Don't worry if it's not perfect because we are going to correct this. brush is quite cool because it follows your stroke, the stroke of your pen, so really slowly I'm going to draw my letters like this, like this, Off, so actually leave it on so it's a little bit weird but what we are going to do is select the pen brush see the size the size is good and we are going to close those gaps here One of the good things about this brush is you can kind of follow the, um, the front and back of your ribbon. So what we are going to do now is go there, duplicate, just in case we need it again. 
again and now with the duplicated layer I'm gonna go to my eraser see the size and we are going to open the letter like this you'll see in a moment why so here I'm gonna use these colors. So let's start with the light blue. I'm on this layer and I'm gonna select and drop. See how easy it is to color your words. So I'm just gonna go to the layer, select. how easy it is with this brush to create a ribbon effect with your lettering but we are gonna make this a little bit better so what I'm gonna do is going to this one duplicate going to the underneath layer I want to use this dark blue as a shadow so I'm gonna click here select this color so the, the, the layer that we've duplicated the one underneath Select my brush in the color dark blue and so that you can see just paint over. Then here we go. Remember this set that we duplicated, just put it here just as a guidance. We are gonna reduce the opacity a little bit. So on the lighter blue, we are gonna go and select and using the eraser, which is the pen, let's see the size, I want to, so we have the light blue, I want the dark blue as a shadow to show, so I want the light blue and underneath I have the dark blue, so this is front of the rainbow ribbon so it's going to be light here this is going to be dark so what i'm going to do is on the stroke and then erase like this front of the ribbon back of the ribbon so i'm going to erase this And as you can 
there you go. You have the word mother that we've created from a black that we've created from a black template. So we can turn this thing on and this one off. We've created with a set of brushes um, a ribbon effect so you can see the light and the dark kind of like the shadow of the ribbon and to add that little special special touch we add some stitches which is quite cool so there you go if you like this tutorial or if you want to see other ones like this make sure to hit the thumbs up button below and subscribe to the channel see you soon and happy drills